Hey guys, thanks for tuning back into my channel. It's your girl Cassie Simmer, and I am back with another video. Thanks for coming to hang out with me today. If you're new to my channel, comment down below. I'm new, so I can personally welcome you. If you're not new, comment down a heart or a smiley face. Welcome back. Today we have the brand new Sims 4 expansion pack, Sims 4 Cottage Living. If you don't know, it just dropped today, July 22nd. So I did just get it. I had it pre-ordered, so I was already ready to go. I love this house. I actually really didn't do anything to it except for add this little addition back here um, my main character for these tutorials are going to be um, Vanessa Vanessa Covington here and she lives with her parents um, her father is half black half Indian and then her mother is just black so they pretty much raised her to love the land eat from the land cherish the land and so that's why they live in this area and um, her parents have grown their farm and now they are leaving it to her So she really has to learn how to tend to everything and they set up everything perfectly for her So now I want her to go ahead and get some farm animals So I'm going to show you guys how to do that today. So let's go into build mode um, So I have here this animal shed and you can pretty much go to outdoor activities and you can find everything that you need in ground garden patch, mounted in grounded, um, garden patch, uh, garden box planter, and then right next to that is going to be the chicken coop. I just made this little area so I can put the chicken coop separately. I didn't want to put the chicken coop with the cow or llama and I didn't want to put it over here with the actual farm and garden and stuff. So I just wanted them to have their own little area I might actually put two. I wonder how many you can put. So it's animal shed. And then I think I might do two chicken coops just to be extra. Um, and then over here is the animal shed. I wonder if I should do, I wonder if I could do two. But anyways, so now I'm going to press play. And then you're going to click on the animal shed. And then you're going to say purchase animal. So you can purchase either a beige llama, a brown cow, a spotted cow, or a white llama. I was going back and forth like, which one do I want? But I really actually want the cow. Just a traditional black and white cow. I think it's so cute. So Vanessa has unlocked recipe for friendly treats. Information about friendly treat animal treat has been added to Vanessa's notebook. Open her, her notebook to learn more so you open the notebook and friendly treat oh okay so any fruit or veggie so now we have our cow here it's so cute let's go say hi to our cow let's go feed it oh this is so cute i wonder if i should do a whole lp with this pack comment down below if you think i should we don't need the welcome wagon Vanessa is an animal enthusiast. Animal enthusiasts enjoy interacting with animals and are better at caring for them. They will feel safe. They will feel sad if they haven't interacted with an animal for a while. All right, so I'm trying to get her to come out here. Go say hi to her new cow. Okay, so I put her to clean it. Oh, look at that. That is so cute. Can I hug it? I want to hug it. Feed. Oh. All right, let's move. So it's the same thing. If you wanted a llama, you can just click on the shed and buy a llama. This cow is so cute. Socialize. What can you do? Ask about bovine university. Pet spotted cow. Let's pet him. I wonder if your friendship grows with a cow. Oh, it does. That is so cool. Oh my gosh. Age, young adult, happiness, happy, clean, full, content, normal milk. Okay. All right. So now let's go to the chicken coop and see what chickens we're going to buy. So you click on the chicken coop and then you say purchase chickens. 
and then there's black hen, black rooster, brown hen, brown rooster, hen chick, rooster chick, white hen, and white rooster. So a hen can lay eggs while they are in a coop. All right, so let's get a hen. A rooster for your coop is a good idea if you want them to breed and create hatchable eggs. Also good to protect the coop from predators and act as an alarm clock. Okay, we'll do that too. Brown hen, same thing. Brown rooster, same thing. All right, so I'm probably going to get two hens, a brown and a black, and then two roosters, brown and black. A hen chick, oh, we'll get both. White rooster, let's get everything. And I wonder if they can go in and out to each one, since we have two anyways. And now I can click on it and say, call chickens out. So they're already coming out. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. All right. Oh, we can name them. Let's feed it. Let's see what happens when we feed it. Look at the little chick. Oh my gosh, the little rooster chick. All right, come on, Vanessa. Let's go feed our roosters and our hens. And then I'm going to buy a few more for this one too. Purchase chickens. So they can all have friends and grow up together. I don't know if this is too much. <laughs> I hope I can care for them all. How do I like feed them? Can I go in? Go here. Feed brown hen. Do I have to feed them all one at a time? Oh no, I can put it on the floor. Okay, good. So yeah, I mean, this is pretty simple and straightforward. I love how it's like, you no know, run around. Look at all of these <laughs> chickens and roosters and chicks. This is so cute. Oh my gosh. So now you have all of these. Oh, and I wonder when I name them, does it change the name? Name Black Rooster Cricket. Oh, it does name it right here. So, yeah, the name is Cricket now. All right, guys. So, that is it. That is how you buy farm animals for your farm. Let me know what other tutorials you guys want me to do on this new pack. And we're going to name our cow. Comment down below what you think we should name the cow. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.